Listen for today by Pastor Chuck, July 19th, The Plot Against Jesus. Mark 3, 6 says, And when the Pharisees went out and immediately plotted with the Herodians against him, that they might destroy him. Logic tells you it would be lawful to do good, no matter what day it was. But because Jesus dared to heal a man on the Sabbath and then defend his actions against their tradition, the Jews sought to kill him. Even today, some feel they must destroy Jesus. The movie industry frequently cast Christians in the negative light, seeking to destroy the influence of Jesus in our society. Organizations have long since fought to remove Jesus from the public sector of our nation, and unfortunately, the Supreme Court has helped them. Don't sit on the fence and look the other way. Why is this happening? It's because, as Jesus said, men love darkness rather than light. Jesus spoke out against adultery, hatred, lying, cheating, and instead taught forgiveness. He taught that we must love God and love one another. But those who are filled with hatred towards God and their fellow men feel they must destroy the message of Jesus. If they can do that, then perhaps they can live their sinful lives without guilt. I believe in the coming days we'll see more of our religious liberties taken and even more oppression of Christianity by the government. Those bent on destroying Jesus won't stop until they can see his influence removed from our society. Don't sit on the fence. Don't look the other way. Make an active stand for the Lord wherever he is attacked. Father, we get so upset at those who go against you, but we know that your kingdom is coming. Hasten the day, Lord. Bring it to pass, your kingdom of righteousness, joy, and peace. In Jesus' name, amen.